In today's video, I'm going to show you how to polish a car hood using Tamiya's polishing compound. You can see the unpolished hood on the left and the polished hood on the right, okay? So in order to do this, we need Tamiya's polishing compounds. We need three of them. So we need the Tamiya's Polishing Compound Course, which is the first one we're going to apply, which is this one here. Then we need Tamiya's Polishing Compound Fine, which is the blue one, which is the second one we will apply. And then we need Tamiya's Polishing Compound Fine, which is the silver one. That will be the last one we will apply. So the uh, first polishing compound we're going to apply is the Tamiya Polishing Compound Course. I like to apply it using an earbud as you can see here okay I apply equal amounts on both sides of the hood and then with the circular motion using the same end I used to apply the polish I then start moving uh, in a circular motion as you see here now all this I'm going to show you in real time the first one and then on the next step I will speed it up because it's pretty much the same step with a different compound. So uh, something I would like to uh, clarify is this model has been painted with a lacquer paint and then it has been gloss coated with pledge uh, floor care. Okay, and then I have left that to dry for two days before I am doing anything with it. So my point is Make sure that you have sealed your model with a proper gloss coat and then you have let that gloss coat uh, dry adequately. So uh, at least one or two days. Once I've cleaned the polish, I like to use a uh, paper towel to clean off any uh, excess, okay? Make sure it's nice and clean. Next, we will now apply Tamiya's polishing compound fine, and we're going to do it the same way, okay? So I'm just going to speed this up because it's the same process again.
Uh, lastly, we're going to apply Tamiya's polishing compound fine, uh, the same way we applied the previous two, okay? Uh, after this one, we're going to see quite a lot of shine, okay, as you'll see. Now for the last step in the process, I like to use a microfiber cloth to polish uh, the fine compound. You can still do it with a paper towel if you wish, however I just think that with a microfiber cloth you get uh, good results. Now once this is done, um, you can choose to leave it uh, here uh, because you'll have a decent shine. However, I just like to go over the entire process one more time. So doing um, the coarse compound again, the fine again, and the finish pot compound one more time. And I'm just going to show you that in times 8 speed because you've already seen it, okay? Let's have a look at it after one final clean. Okay. Here we go, nice and shiny.